How's it going? I don't know why you call the cops. It's crazy. Crazy. She asked for your license? For, for what? No, you're not getting ID. We haven't done anything wrong. About to do what? What am I about to do? Can you tell me who you are? In your name? You have to. You're, you're telling me. If you're giving me can't tell me what to do. You know, hello, how's it going? Yeah, what's going on? 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 All right, guys, we're here at the Provincetown Police Station. And I'm here with Wandering Hippie, or Fun Loving Bunny. This is a call box, yeah. They got the thin blue line heart. It's the public entrance, but you can't get in. Isn't that funny? I'm willing. I'm willing to try the door. Open. Yeah. Oh, what does that smell? Oh, it stinks in here, dude. What is that? Hello. How are you? Well, first off, it's what's that smell? Oh, it does smell in here. Oh. It always smells like that. Woof. It's like I don't know. Drug smell like, but maybe it's the oh, it's the dog food. Ah, okay. That's what I'm thinking. I'm smelling right now. Woof. Just checking out the place, you know. It's pretty small. Excuse me. Are you the conference. Uh, Let's put the light I'm on. I'm from the Cape. Yeah. Yeah. yeah is there anything going in town today? Uh, pretty busy. Yeah. Definitely hot. Can I get your first name, dear? Thank you very much. You're very kind. Are there a lot of people downtown? Yeah, it's pretty busy. Yeah. 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 Even though it's end of August, school starting. Right? Yeah, well, you know, if, you're, if you've lived here for a while, you know, we kind of pick up a little bit with foreign Canada and blah, 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 come a little later in the season because they know the season's over. Yeah. You want to... Is there Did, any complaint forms here? Is the, Where's the parking enforcement? Um, where are they at now? Oh really? They don't have a location? What? You can't there's no location? No, for all um tickets or complaints you can go to town hall to the town Street for four months. Uh, okay. Public record. Like here, and then, their phone number and everyone will contact them now. I don't know if you'll know this question, but like if you don't pay your ticket, what happens? If you don't pay your ticket um for your vehicle, your your registration gets the registered owner of the vehicle, they get suspended and the registration becomes um I think revoked. After one after one ticket not being paid? Yeah, because it's unpaid fines or costs, it directly affects your registration and the registered owner of that vehicle. Wow. Yeah. That's a little egregious. Yeah, I mean it's if you don't pay your ticket, um if you get a ticket here in town, you can um fill out an appeal You can fill out one of these right here. Yeah, is that the appeal form? Yeah, ticket dispute form, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it, 
That's that's a little excessive though, just after one ticket not being paid for. And then you can only do it online and you gotta go to town hall. I mean you can do it here, you can fill out the appeal form, but Okay. Yeah. yeah that's wild. Okay, that's good to know. Thank you. Um, I have a question. Um, what do you know? What the supervisor's name is? We have many supervisors. Who are you looking for? Okay, there was a supervisor earlier that we talked to, but I was wondering if uh, there's a new supervisor on shift. Um, I think it was it was Sergeant Enos who. Yes, I believe he called Sergeant Enos over yep. the cemetery yep. earlier today. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, or his or want, his supervisor. We don't want to speak to him because he gave us a hard time for no reason, basically. So we want to. What I want to do is, you know, fill out a complaint. You know, yeah, of course. he was a bit disrespectful. He he told him his attitude sucks on camera. That's I didn't. I didn't do anything. You know, I was just there filming, and then they're threatening me with the arrest. you know ID and arrest. Like for what? So I want to, you know. Can we get the name of the um, detective as well that threatened me with arrest and stuff? She, she wouldn't, wouldn't identify. Give her name. So we can't even make a complaint. I believe it's your policy too that to identify when asked. Yeah. Yep, she knows. She knows. Yeah. I appreciate your decency, by the way. I know you know what what we do, but uh, you're very you're very kind. I appreciate like, that. They they are, they could be good people. Yeah. Awesome. No, they could be good people, but somehow this thing got them triggered and they made a mistake and they need to follow the law. Just as much as we are, you know, and we're following the law to a T. I think it's because, well, I, guess, I, guess, uh, I think it's because it's a cemetery. We got, we get a lot of people coming in and out of the cemetery. Sure. But we had like public employees flipping us off and, because you know. It's a cemetery. And it's I mean, that, I wouldn't flip you off if you were in the wrong place, you know. I mean, that's just not. Very polite of a public employee and stuff, yeah. Any type of call like that. Right. I think the call was was about us looking in vehicles, actually. It had nothing to do with the cemetery. From what I heard the officer say with my own ears and on here, the call was made. I appreciate your decency. You're very kind. So, for any officer complaints, yep. whether it be the detective or the sergeant who you guys spoke with, you can email uh, our lieutenant. Okay. Lieutenant Hennick. We can't fill out paperwork and then, like, have you acknowledge that we did the paperwork so that way we don't know that the email didn't just disappear? Or I guarantee you, it, it if we want it in writing, it should be. It has to be done in writing. Like, so we don't have to do the email process. That's alternative. That's option. I believe that uh, you should at least have complaint forms here you that can. we could fill out, or we could just write on a piece of paper. It don't matter. Thank you very much. Okay, Hello, thank how's it going? Hi, how are you? How are you going, bud? What's going on? How can I help you today? Well, we just we kind of had a little interaction with you guys down at the uh, at the uh, cemetery. Okay. And, uh, you know, we need to make a couple of complaints. One, okay. we had the detective, you know, spitting orders that we're going to... Nice lady, but uh, she said, oh, you can make a complaint on email. Okay. And, uh, you know, I'd rather do that on paper. Okay. And then get a receipt that I gave it. Yeah. So yeah. that we know that it actually happens and not just uh, gets lost in the email. So, okay. I just have a question real quick is, like, maybe you can help us with the complaint. Is um, Do you know that detective's name is a woman? Uh, she was wearing gray. She didn't have any identification, but I, someone said that uh, from the grapevine uh, that she was a detective, I think. Wow. Uh, she failed to ID. She was trying to force us to ID wrongfully okay. with the rest and everything. It's wrong. Uh, we hadn't done anything wrong. Okay. Um, and Can you uh, kind of fill in the gaps for me here? Like, when did this happen? Like Earlier today. Earlier today. Where, yeah, where about was it? About two hours, maybe two and a half hours ago. Where was this? At the uh, DPW uh, down at the uh, graveyard. Okay, I'd have to look at the calls for service and right. figure out who I was believe, responded. You know, she, she mentioned something about what the call was, and I believe the call was because we were looking in some cars that were there, which were the employees' cars. And okay. even if it wasn't, that's not against the law either. You know, I can look in your car, I can look in anybody's car who's It's in public, you know. Yeah. So... But, you know, it's just the attitude. Yep. I'm a very friendly guy. I'm very kind. I was not doing anything wrong. This okay. this whole crap of, you know, you're going to be under arrest if mm -hmm. you don't ID and blah, blah, blah. Yeah. 
that's that's not very okay so if, so as far as the, com the complaint procedure is concerned we don't have a complaint form that you can file Wait, like it we can sit down with each you other don't have a complaint we, we, we do not we do not have a complaint form sir so like i can do it verbally with you and you write it down or something yeah, we can have a seat down in the conference room if you want That'd we can stand great. here if yeah. you want to do that i'm and, okay with that uh, I'm okay. yeah and, whatever you want to I can take that information figure out who you folks are because we have to identify maybe people that file complaints no you don't you can get my email. no you do not okay yeah, that's fine yeah, yeah. okay um, yeah you just need a contact which makes well, sense I, well, ultimately we if we we can't identify the people that are trying to file a complaint we can't substantiate the complaint either so no oh, i don't believe that so what, i just no. I need to know you, who can't, you, folks you, can't, are. you can't post a, a complaint um anonymously anonymously you, you can you can report but as far as the follow up and the feedback and to get back to you. Well, guys, well, we'll be back. Well, the only thing I'm not okay. looking I'm not looking to sue or anything like that. But what I am looking for is accountability. Okay. So she needs to like have certain reprimations for her actions. Like okay. she needs to either be trained properly. And if I you know if I get an email saying that and uh, hopefully it did happen. I'm not getting lied to. Uh, and that you know that's all we, we really want. And we'll give you a link. So the video, so you can watch it for yourself. But I, I offer, but I just want to say I offer not filing the complaint if you brought her in here and talked to her and we can you can confirm that actually happened. Well, I, I can I, from who I think may have responded. They're not working. That's their their day shift personnel. That her her name is so Detective, she wasn't even Detective Lober. Lober. Yeah, is okay. her name as I, as I believe or I remember who was uh, who responded. I just have to look at the call. Just so to, she wasn't even on duty. What do you mean she's not? She's not on duty now. Right. She's not working. The, she's not working the evening. Was shift. she on duty when when she was making threats about arrest and blah blah blah? I I believe so. If she was an officer that responded. Then yes. She was in a white truck, not a police car. Above, above. It's one of that's one of our unmarked okay. vehicles. Okay. Cool. Yeah. yeah. And what's the deal with that? Is you guys allowed to have the unmarked vehicles? Yeah. Yep. Okay. And all right. All right. Yeah, I know Hyannis does it too. Yeah, we're yeah. all we're all allowed to have them. All police departments are. Yeah, they're governed by you know on, under the uh, state law. Like so, there's other states that do like the ghost lettering. Yeah, I, I think so, some departments have some departments have the traffic cars like that. But that's uh, a workaround. They're supposed to uh, clearly display that they're police in other other places. Here, you got allowed to have undercovers, but I still think it's very disingenuous. Even the ghost lettering. Because it's like, all right, you you got the stencil on there, you got the graphics on there, but you're not like, you yeah, know, we, we don't, we that's don't, all they require. Yeah, we, 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 we don't have the ghost letter now. Even in Hyannis, they have like red plates, not blue plates. You yeah, know? but I, I, mean, I, get yeah, it. I it's, don't know it's more the principle. It's it's disingenuous. I think we should know where it's you guys strange. are. Because it, what if someone needed yeah, help? It's, it's, it's not, How long before you get over there? I'm sorry to cut them off. Uh, they're, they're estimating uh, spring of 2024. Oh yeah, Stinks in here? Is that your problem? Yeah, yeah it does. It's the food, I think. Yeah, it has like a, is, yeah. So do you want to sit down with Hey, I, I mean, like, what I'm going to probably do it by email. I right. think, yeah, yeah. I think it's just good that you're aware of it and that you could just communicate that to her. And, okay. you how know, about, how about let's do a, an apology would be nice. I'm not demanding it or anything. Uh, I certainly won't file a complaint if you don't you want, apologize. You want, you want to file the public records on her name and, and uh, salary? Yeah, I think that would be good. So it just reminds the public of you know how much she makes and how she's treating the public making that money. Okay, That I mean, would be listen, good. We're not anti-cop, bro. We would have been so friendly if they had been friendly. Yeah, you know, I understand. I, I hear you ever saying. You know what I mean? Yeah. I, I'm pro-cop. I've done commendations for you guys when you've showed up and, and stuck up for my rights because you know I have a yep. right to film anything. You of course. Know what I mean? Yep, so, absolutely you do. So I appreciate your, your being decent. What do you want to do? Um, we can do the uh, FOIA request for her salary. Okay. And I'll do a complaint if necessary online. You can do the complaint whatever which way you want to do. Yeah, I definitely but that's how I'm going to play this. So I just want her to educate and be, you know. you know. Yep. Okay. Yep. Because okay. it's dangerous. Yeah. You know, even the DP workers, I should be following a... Flipping me off? I should file a complaint against them for calling the cops. That's a... That's a you know why you know that's you can't call the cops for people not breaking the law, right? Well, you can call you can call the police for anything. We're going to respond to assist anyone that thinks they need assistance. But that's ultimately, wasting resources. Like, I, and, and I, I hear what you're saying, but ultimately we go where we're asked to be. Okay. All right. Good to know. All right. Uh, I'll do the FOIA request. Mean, we'll, we'll mail it in or something. Let's yeah, that's well, correct. Request one. Do you want one? Oh yeah. Time? Okay. I, I want to do it right now. I'll okay, do it right yeah, now. Not a problem. Yeah, because when I release this video, I'll, hopefully I'll have all this information. Before before I give this to you, let me just make some more copies before I run my run yeah. Out. No worries, no worries. It could be on just a random piece of paper. Oh, thank you. I don't really need this though. Thank you though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just the parking. Actually, we talked to the parking enforcement guys. He's very friendly. He's, he, he's such a jokester. Password to my phone, too. No, I'm just kidding. Pretty quiet. You're not like getting calls or anything, huh? Don't say that. Don't say that. 
Oh, I'm sorry. I don't mean to. I don't mean to. Uh, <laughs> We, we, we do this a lot. What we do is we listen to fire and then we, we respond to where you guys go based on fire calls. And, uh, so do you listen to our fire calls? I do. So you know that they're pretty crazy? Yeah, I, we were in Hyannis the other night. Uh, you know, I feel, I feel bad for a lot of what you guys go through, you know. I'm not anti-cop by any means at all. Thank you. Yep. Appreciate that. Uh, right here. Anything necessary for this case? Okay. For, for this so request? Gonna, so you don't want to specify the case number with it? It does. That's still going to be a different records request. Oh, so you'll fill out two of them? Yeah, okay. we'll, we're going to wait until later. He's going to do that one. Okay. Yep. All right. You guys got body cams yet, Serge? Yes, sir. We're, uh, we're still waiting on the report from the, the body camera commission. Yeah. Can, can you do it voluntarily? The department? Yeah, no. can you do it personally? Like, you could, you know, tell your, your boss, like, hey, I'm, I'm wearing a body cam. It's ultimately it's a department decision. I I can't just I just sure can't is. throw a body oh, yeah. camera on my body without them saying, you know, hey. Yeah, this is like one fifty. Yeah, you know, if they let you do it. Department, the department was going to make the investment all at the same time that we're all that way we're all trained on it. But you guys have never pulled your cell phone out to record something. I mean, no, we're not legally allowed to. Oh, oh okay. Yeah, no, we're not. All right, good we to had know. a good talk with Hyannis about that yesterday about you know how they would like to have them just because you know you I agree. I, I, you I'm can great, use it I'm against me I, just as much as I can yeah, use no, it against I, I, you. I, I think I'm you should. Forward, you know, I, I think they they do a lot better than not. I I can see how some people would be naturally intimidated by them. Right. But um, I I I, I have no qualms about someone recording me or vice versa. You know, but ultimately we we want to be within you know the confines of the law that way right. people yeah i just feel like it helps you as much as it helps us trained to turn it off um yeah the, the, the visual is still recording all that stuff but yeah yeah i get it but people will come around eventually it's yeah, all about we're, education we're, we're waiting on the report from the body camera commission okay the report allegedly was due at the end of june um with the post certification so allegedly within the within six months i believe was the window they were given yeah for the report to be released reviewed by the legislature then the funding comes into I don't place know why they just help. The Why they just don't give them to you? Obviously, we know from other states well, the, that there's a lot, there's a there's a lot of money that goes into the storage of the right. files. Right. Uh, yeah, the files. Yeah, that's what that's what you all guys are saying. It's true because you'd be posting a hundred, you know, uploading hundreds of videos a month, and then you got to go through them. It's like a whole another yeah, process. It for X amount of, X amount of time, yeah. That is. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. That's how the state police do it. They have a giant server somewhere. When they come in, they put it, it the machine in, and it uploads to somewhere else. Yeah. So they don't even have access to it you right, know exactly. which is pretty interesting exactly i don't want to keep you anymore you have a great day brother thank Stay you guys love you thank you appreciate it all right guys I think that yeah was, that went pretty well think? they did well yeah and uh i uh i think that when it comes to the supervisor um like he was a supervisor but the other supervisor that came i think maybe we should have pressed harder on him a little bit um but he can't. This guy is not going to help us with that because he's, you know, it's his partner. It's his partner in crime. You want to go walk around in the fire station? Partner in crime. We could go. It's just closed. Uh, yeah. It says do not enter, but there's no signage to say you can't go back there. No vehicles. Go back there, but no. No, they're not going to do anything. I've been I'm not worried about it. All right. All right. All right. I'm going to sign off, guys. We're going to do one final records request, and you'll probably see that later on. We can, uh, you know, if you want to see that, I'm sure Wandering Hippie is going to get the report on his channel, so check him out. Um, I'm going to wait back to hear uh, what her salary is and her, yeah, and plus all the overtime. I requested her salary, her overtime, and uh, any expenses that she uh, uses. So, like, you know, her spending for personal or pri uh, private with the town's money. So... Um, did they give you a name? Yeah. Lober. 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 It's like L O B U E R. Lober. Labor. All right. All right, let's go. Let's go. Did you drop something or no? On the ground, right, right outside the door? No, it was just my keys. He went past the exit, so he's, he can't turn around now. I guess he goes way down. He's a huge. Wow, he was.
trying to retaliate, wasn't he? Yeah, absolutely. Buckle up. Just keep down you. So he can come up right here on this intersection. Is that him again right there? So take a right or a left? Is that a different P Town cop, though? Take a right? Yeah, yeah. I told you. I told you about the freaking parking backwards. You didn't get to park backwards that time, no, but. No, but, no, but before, remember? They don't have the plate readers here, true or this. No, he had it right, right across the street, but I just want to make sure I'm not going to bust his chops right now. I don't see him over here. Uh, he went straight. He went beyond this exit right here to the next one. So I think he caught the hint that we knew he was following us. Sure, right? no, he knew we knew right away. Look, he's right there. He's right, right there. That's, that's true. Put her brake lights on. I actually All right, so uh, take a left when you get to the edge of section here, and then uh, we'll guide you right up to his bike. It's fucked up. I don't want to get pulled over right now. No, I hear you. What could he pull you over for, though? Nothing. He's going to try to run the plates, but that's also retaliatory. Ow, all day. All he fucking day. He can call day. your plate in. Take legally. a right? Yeah, a left. A left. He can call in your plate legally. I had this argument with the cops before. Legally, in public, as long as you're not on private property, he can call your plate whatever he wants. Whoa. I'm not even pushing hard. It's the it's the wheels. It's yeah, that. now it's the paint. My bike almost wipes out every time I hit that shit. Exciting, my heart's still beating. Well, I just, you would have got a ticket for him. No. no, I mean legally. I'm not sure, I'm pretty sure I can just get out and walk away. Just to fucking rattle his chain. He's not coming though. He's there, but he's not coming. He wants to see us leave town. It's intimidation. Boy, there's a giant roadblock up here. <laughs> Slowly coming. Here he comes. Hey, guys, so we Just, have... Uh, Justy, the... Justy's blocking your plate, bro. Right. Guys, we have the Pro uh, Provincetown police behind us. He's retaliating against us for doing a records request and getting a uh, complaint form. Um, he is... Uh, I don't know if you can see. Kind of hard to see behind us. But yeah, it's fucked up, guys. It's retaliatory all day. He was just chasing us around. I, I turned off, and he, he's trying to get plates. So he can do whatever he wants, but um, it's just wrong what he's doing. It's absolutely wrong. Yeah, it was great. He duped him. He pulled down some road. Oh, shit. There's another one right there. Here he comes. And he's leaving, too. They're going to get us, bro. For what? I don't know. We got two officers behind us now for no reason at all in Provincetown. I filed Should a complaint against them. Yeah, I'd go live. It might be hard to get live out here. It's wrong what they're doing. It's absolutely wrong. Is he going to pull us over? I see him. I see him. I'm going to flick him off. Flick him off. You back there, too. Is he been right behind us? No, he, he, he pulled off. That's not him behind us. To show their power. We got cruiser 6061 retaliating against us. How dare you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, right away, Churro, please 
got some pull over right there. Uh, that's great. How dare you, you piece of shit. Wow, bro. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. They're, they're we cowards. Got, we got lots of talents to drop out about the cape. They can retaliate all the way to fucking East Bay. Unbelievable, guys. They did it. They retaliated. I want to file a complaint against that for sure. Yo, man, you got a cigarette bum off here? Yeah. Free Talk Live. Oh, thanks. Appreciate that. You all right? Yeah, I'll take your light. I'll buy your lungs, too. Yeah, man. Oh, what you wish then to there? Oh, this? This is Free Talk Live. You never heard of them? No, you can call in. You can say whatever you want, man. It's free talk, free speech. Hell yeah. Yeah, isn't that cool? Hell yeah, that's what's up. I'll check them out. Thanks for the sig, man. Appreciate it. No problem. <laughs>